Hey, Sarah. I'm getting too used to this. How long? Weeks. Relax. You haven't missed much. The Ark and the Sleepers, they're safe in the Sphere? You better like where we parked, because it's home now. The Sleepers wake to an amazing view. We did it, Dad. What about your implant and Sam? I am once again helping the Pathfinder activate Remnant. Our connection has been restored to normal. Normal? You need him again? I'll take the help. I was turning my brain inside out. That is exceptionally inaccurate. Well, it felt like it. Didn't it, Sarah? The Nexus leaders are waiting, Pathfinder. Duty calls. Better not keep them waiting. It never ends. The decision isn't yours. Neither is it yours. That is the point, isn't it? Pathfinder, you're late. All right, get to it. What's so important? Initiative protocol. Thanks to you, we can finally proceed as intended. As outposts become colonies, the cluster needs its own voice. A true council. And while I maintain that it is premature, we must nominate an interim ambassador to represent concerns outside the Nexus. Or rather, you must nominate someone. If this person is supposed to represent people, shouldn't the people have a say? That is precisely why we need your backing. We can't impose a vote on the Angar. Or even Kadara. Eladin? <laughs> Won't happen. But you've acted for everyone. If you endorse a name, some may disagree, but they will trust it as a starting point. Someone to speak for Helios. I put forward Pathfinder Hager. I'd suggest you, but someone might think you killed the Archon to elevate yourself. We can't allow the appearance of that. But Hager keeps the position, and the timeline, in the Nexus family. The Angara need to help define the process. It's their right. Plus, the Moshai would help solidify relations. We're already partnered, thanks to your efforts against the Rokar. All the more reason to focus on our own issues. It feels like the original intent was to give that voice to the outposts. August Bradley's approving leader. On a considerably smaller scale. He's kept Eos relatively stable, despite no militia presence. Meridian doesn't mean done. Cat are still out there. A Pathfinder is the obvious choice for stability. For us. But hardly the empowering one. Same old bullshit. If we want stability, maybe we should ensure the Krogan stay. What if it was Morda? <laughs> you are out of your mind. It's definitely unorthodox. If we're going to treat Helios like a home, we need to acknowledge whose home it is. I won't name anyone. I support asking the Moshai to act as interim ambassador. Meridian's opening day, and we're surrendering how much influence? That's the point, you colonial ward. Sarah is feeling better. Good. This decision, the policy and protocol, that's not what your victory was about. There's more to life than this. Integration of Hyperion systems is ongoing. Our SAM node will be accessible on return visits to Meridian. Integration of Hyperion systems is ongoing. Our SAM node will be accessible on return See, visits to Meridian. Worked out with only the exceptional help of the gifted and trained. That's all it takes. Looking good. Well, hello. Hello yourself. Eyes front. Try not to swoon. I want you... 
I want you more. I need proof. Soon. Well, let's get this show on the road. Meridian looks great, but, you know, been there, done that. Hey, this was a big accomplishment. It's important to enjoy it. Don't get me wrong. I'm proud of us. Helios is changing, and will be for a long time. I'm just antsy. Don't want to miss a thing. Oh, I almost forgot. Kalinda sent a congratulatory message. She was angling for an invitation, I think. Denied. Hope you didn't turn her back into an enemy. Oh, you're always so serious. Enjoy the moment. We're here to celebrate, remember? What am I gonna do with you, PB? I'll send you a list. For now, you're right. The galaxy isn't going anywhere. Let's have some fun. Still standing? Still standing. Then I did my job. Somehow. Nothing more need be said. There's one thing. Dr. Lexi Tapero. thank you. <laughs> yeah, that did it. You jerk. Go on. I have a reputation to protect. Good to be out of cryo. I didn't organize anything. Not this. Landing day. That was worth jumping galaxies. Hey, Ryder. So, this is supposed to be a celebration, right? You getting used to any of this yet? Meridian? The dream becoming a reality? We're not done by a long shot. Come on, try to ease up a little. Enjoy the win. But, so you know, I've got the Tempest topped out and ready. You want to blow this hot dog stand? Just say the word. Callow's out there somewhere, time one on. If we're really sneaky, he won't even notice we're gone. Who's flying, then? You? Why the hell not? I'm a quick study. How hard can it be? Hard. And how about the Nomad? Just once around the planet. No. Ugh. Guess I'll just have fun down here. Honored to see you, Pathfinder. Glad to have you. A fantastic turn of fortune for the Hyperion. Perhaps one day the Parchero can expect the same. In not quite so dramatic a fashion, hopefully. Ryder. Look who it is. Looking good, Ryder. What does this mean, Sam? The language is imprecise, or perhaps too precise, but the potential capacity of Meridian is clear. Unlimited. Meridian, huh? I see it every day, and I'm still amazed. We're really starting to put down roots. It's wonderful. Did I tell you? The team's working with the Angara to set up a joint research body. That sounds exciting. I know. I can't wait. Us helping them, them helping us. Can you imagine what we could accomplish? <sighs> I'm getting all misty just thinking about it. This was always what was intended. Nice to be here, finally. We always knew what we wanted, but for a while, we couldn't see it. Now it's here, it's happening, and it's beautiful. Look who it is.
Up straight, everyone. This is the guest of honor. Well, like you have to tell anyone that. Hunter, this is our opening. Let there be some sense of ceremony. As I was about to say, hello, Pathfinder. I am Chief of Operations, Ayora Pile. Second Wave Placements Officer, Darlavas Hyperion. Hunter Carey, Reconstruction. Darlavas Hyperion, Placements Officer? As our developments in the cluster grow more sophisticated, proper matching of sleeper and assignment will be vital. My mission is to ensure compatibility and fulfillment. When are you changing your name to Vast Meridian? I keep Vast Hyperion to honor the ship that brought us here, as my godparents would want. Just saying we're staying. Please forgive Hunter. He is an ass. Ayora Pillay, you're in charge of Meridian? That's a big statement. I will oversee the operations and establishment of our port. Exploration and study of the... interesting substructure will be handled by Initiative R&D. I'm told that may take lifetimes. We'll ensure that we have them. That's what I trained for. Hunter Kelly, can I get some clarification on reconstruction? Sure thing. I'm tasked with turning this once proud vessel into the future proud human capital. It's more complicated than that. No, it's a structural and organizational nightmare. Which is job security, which is perfect. Come back in a year. This'll be a galactic hub. You won't know where the Hyperion ends and Meridian begins. This is the first I've heard of the term second wave. It isn't literal. There have been several groups deployed for outposts. Second wave is about the staged evolution of the initiative. First wave out of cryo, structural support and generalists. Food and fences. Second wave is organizational. Less generalists, more specialists. More paperwork. It's needed to rapidly advance. I'm not spending a generation on the range. Sounds like Meridian is in good hands. I can only read the reports of how you brought us this opportunity, but rest assured, we will not waste it. Yes. Thank you, Pathfinder. Hi. what they said. Thank you, Pathfinder. I'll pay it forward, I swear. <laughs> so this is how you all party, hmm? <laughs> Pretty tame, but don't tell the host I said that. Meridian is amazing, though. You accomplished the inconceivable. I'm grateful to be part of it. No, I'm grateful. I couldn't have asked for a better team. We created this together. And exactly what it is, what it may become, <laughs> I can't even imagine. To think that when we met, the Angara and your initiative struggled to find trust. The way we arrived on Aya was over the top. You know, uninvited and on fire. Agreed. <laughs> Guess it worked out okay. <sighs> Ryder, the Angara will never forget how you saved the Moshrai. But more than that, we'll never forget how you fought the Ket beside us. How we destroyed the Archon. Meridian is a new beginning for your people and mine. Together. New beginnings. That's what I came to Helios for. And what I dreamed of. Yes. <laughs> New beginnings. So, let's get to it. Hey, Ryder. How's Sarah? Much better. There might be two Riders around soon, imagine. The Hyperion's forming scientific teams. Gotta start studying what we have. I may have helped them organize. It's what you do. Meridian won't know what hit it. And we should think about what's next. This is a new cradle for humanity. That's a big idea. Bigger than I'd imagined. So maybe building those teams was smart. Small steps to understand all this. 
until we're at the top of the mountain. And seeing the next horizon? Can't deny it. I'm game for more. With so much power in our hands, you think it'll be okay? Small steps, like you said. There's no rush to figure all this out. Right. If nothing else, Meridian gives us time. Whatever happens, you gave everyone an incredible gift. Nice job, Pathfinder. It's overwhelming. I don't know where to start, but I can. I don't care which world I'm on. It's all... Ready whenever. Pathfinder! Here! How's things? Even these Jardin were surprised at what they created. It is not uncommon for a creator to be surpassed by their creation. Couldn't anyone else have said that? Kid. Old man? Ha ha ha. This place is something else. It's just another starting line. Where we go from here is on us. Well, damn, you were listening to me after all. Through all the creaking of your old bones. <laughs> I sent out the Nakmore scouts. Nearly drowned me in reports until I pointed them at Tan. Told him to be extra wordy just for him. He'll love that. He wanted the job, he can have the reports. It's not over, you know. There'll be more Ket and whatever else is waiting out there. Whatever happens, we'll be ready for it. Pathfinder and crew ready to take on the galaxy, huh? They won't know what hit him. So, Tan says he's gonna let me stick around and help with the... Hey, Ryder. What's the word on the street? Ryder saves the day. Pathfinder of the century. You know, the usual. Still? Get used to it. They're gonna name things after you when you die. And probably even before. So we heading out again soon? Oh, she's all grown up, leaving home, doesn't need me anymore. <laughs> That'll be the day. We'll handle my deals on this end while I'm gone. Seeing you two in cahoots <laughs> makes me all misty. You know this is your fault, right? Helping us along? Helis has really turned into the fresh start I wanted. In so many ways. And now with Meridian, we're really going to make this place ours. I can't wait. You know where to find me when you're ready. Hi, Ryder. You have Hi, to see this. So glad you're up and around. I have important news for you. There always is. Yes, discoveries every day, but this is something we've been waiting for. Listen. What should I be hearing? Sorry, Sam. Active filtering. Initiative Protocol Alpha Alpha to the screen. Protocol what? Processing. Repeating! This is the Ark Kirathia! The situation is not under control! Not an avoid until further update! Repeating! Is that...? The Corian Ark? And Elcor? Drell? Volus? Hanar, I think. That's some delicate business, putting Hanar in stasis. Point is, they're still out there. The Kilasia wasn't destroyed. That's fantastic news. We need to report this right away. It's good news, but it bounced too many times to trace and... That's not a distress call. It's a warning to keep away from... wherever they are. Whatever's happening, they don't want to be found yet. We have to trust their Pathfinder. All we can do is wait. How's things? Ready whenever. Pathfinder, catch see for you in your planet. That's not getting less weird. About time Iridium got a proper grand opening. We all need this. Heard Sarah woke up. How's she doing? She'll be back on duty in no time. Too soon, if we let her. So, you're telling me you're having trouble explaining limits to a rider? Hey, know who I just talked to? A second wave technician fresh out of cryo. Just had his first sunrise in Andromeda. He couldn't stop crying. Just him? <laughs> uh, must be something going around. 
Maybe you're the carrier. We're still outsiders to a lot of people. But this? It's almost home. They haven't given you five minutes alone since the fight. Have you had a chance to let it sink in? Sometimes I just stare out the window, thinking, we did it. It's hard to believe. I feel you. Just... ground under our feet, knowing it's ours. I can't wait for more people to wake up. Enjoy it, Pathfinder Rider. Tomorrow, we're back on the job. It's overwhelming. I don't know where to start, but I can. I don't care which world I'm on. It's all more than I hoped. If you're expecting a pat on the back, you're going to be disappointed. You didn't disappoint me on the battlefield. When I enter an alliance, I mean it. Besides, I enjoy kicking some cat ass. We have that in common. That's where the similarities begin and end, Pathfinder. It's overwhelming. I don't know where to start, but I can. I don't Pathfinder. Care I'm told I'm about to get exceptionally hope. busy. Which, given your health, is unwise. We all gave of ourselves, Zephra. It was time. And as this ambassador, I will continue to do so. I couldn't impose a voice on the Angara, temporary or not. We've always had a voice. This just means your leaders have decided to listen. Also, don't assume my name brings universal approval. You know how varied our opinions can be. I can't speak for everyone, but I will gladly help create the system that does. Ansala Venjuri, Pathfinder. There is much yet to learn. It's overwhelming. I don't know where to start, but I can. Ready whenever. I don't care which world I'm on. Hello, Ryder. More than I hoped. I heard about those Ken. Thank you, Pathfinder. Ryder, enjoying the fruits of your labor? You deserve it. Thanks, Callow. The Tempest is getting some much-needed service. I thought I'd leave them to it. But I wouldn't miss the big day. Meridian looks so different out of the cockpit. I think I understand better why you do what you do. Finding Meridian crystallized a lot of things about being a Pathfinder. I expect many around here are thinking about their own potential. I don't pretend to understand everything. But Meridian must have opened a lot of doors, not all of them safe. I want you to know that it'll be my privilege to keep flying you to them. It means a lot that you want to stick with us, Callum. Of course. And keeping my ship is a plus. I've learned a lot from you, Ryder. And Gil. Though, th please don't tell him that. Things will change now. But that's all right. Nothing's ever really lost. Thank you, Pathfinder. I'll pay it forward, I swear. Arc Hyperion, departed Milky Way 2185, arrived Andromeda 2819. Current status recorded as Meridian. Well, narrator guy is getting work. Please select a topic. Arc Hyperion has been declared a monument to those who lost their lives in service of the initiative. A plaque has been placed at the highest point of the Hyperion superstructure. It reads, we turned our backs upon a dwindling star to chase a dawn beyond our childhood's end.
The Hyperion was shepherded to its resting place by a coalition of allies who stood as one against the Ket Archon. Pathfinder Riders spearheaded the defense, and remains assigned to Arc Hyperion despite its reclassification. Landing Day has been proposed as a cluster-wide holiday. Status, pending. While decommissioned as a vessel, the superstructure silhouette of Arc Hyperion will be maintained in perpetuity. All internal structures are being adapted for sleeper deployment and future industrial and residential development. These internal structures have been designated as Port Meridian. The transformation of Arc Hyperion into Port Meridian continues both above and below the surface. This includes the planned integration of initiative and remnant technologies, pending further research. Port Meridian is currently powered by repurposed Tantalus drive cores, which require the frequent discharge of static energy. This causes a unique visual phenomenon during Meridian's night cycle that has been dubbed Aurora Meridiani. Ready for anything. Hi, Ryder. Living so soon? Figured I'd leave before I teared up. No one needs to see that. Some may want to see exactly that. To know you feel the same as they do. I'm new to this role myself. The training didn't cover how to honor your peers. There's no protocol. Your father invented this role, but you defined it. We've achieved a lot, but the initiative still needs us. And if I know my crew, you want to get back out there. Let's get to work. <laughs> 